Okay, hey, what's going on guys? My friend here another video and today <coughs> in this video I'm gonna show you guys how to get the b b Buffalo Police Charger in GTA 5 um, We're first off gonna go to Franklin <coughs> um, as I'm gonna put him in the front garage of his house um, Actually so first off you gotta go into direct mode. And just let it load. I'm I'm gonna use uh Michael um for this but you can use any um character in <coughs> direct mode that you want. Um so you're gonna want to stay near here. <coughs> what time is it? Uh, you're gonna also want to change it to 12 o'clock, that's when I first found it, <coughs> that, that time. Um, then it should, <coughs> in theory, just spawn somewhere around here. I'm gonna steal this car so we can drive. Around here somewhere. Oh, we didn't turn these off. Uh, okay. <coughs> I recommend disabling that and putting invincibility on. Um, so, you know the normal trick where you just go around here? Don't have to do that, but, but in single player that doesn't really work. Um, <coughs> uh, where is it? Why you pull over? Damn, damn lady. Nice. Hmm, this is normally just spawns around it. Because in my last ever video for our episode on the Xbox, um, I saw one straight away as I was doing the intro. <coughs> oh. um, I'm just going to drive up and down. I'm just going to speed uh, time lapse this so you guys don't think I've just spawned it in or something. Um, yeah. Gonna look around here. Okay, we have found it. Look at this. Alright, so we're just gonna put our lights on. Go in front of it. Now just walk up to them. Chuck them out the vehicle. Kill them. Get in car. Drive to garage. Well, actually, in my case, you have to. Well, no, you just have to drive to um, one of the single players' uh, houses. So, in my case, I'm going to Michael's. So yeah, that took w longer than it did for me the first time. I will say that because <laughs> that was um, <coughs> about ten 
ish minutes. Um, so yeah. But we've got it now. Yeah. Um, one thing I'm trying to find still is the the buffalo with the like eagle on the front. Um, so after this video, I'm just gonna keep looking for that. Yeah. So what you do is you go to the house. You go like me. Can I do that thing? There we go. That's the best sound. Eek! Right. So you see we're at Michael's house. Uh, the gate should open. And if you don't have anything in these. In here. Which I do. Uh, the black one can go. kind of like that purple one. Um, <coughs> so what you can do. Just reverse this out. Alright. This is a. Uh, to be a challenge in itself. Alright, there we go. Get that vehicle out. And go over here. And then. Just put that in there. And then you want to exit direct mode. Like so. Okay, so <coughs> we're currently Franklin. Gonna go over to uh, Michael. It's a weird noise. Uh, you are such a selfish asshole, Dad. Seriously. Really? You. Thanks. Angel. I'm sorry. Do whatever you want. Am I meant to find a job? Or is it job meant to find me? <laughs> <laughs> oh, these guys are stupid. And you see it's here now. Wrong vehicle. There you go. Now what you're going to want to do, once you've done that, put the buffalo in there. You're going to want to drive to your garage and just put it in there. Then you should be able to access it in... Uh, direct mode to do like a police role play thing. Yeah. Um, that's the only way I've found it. Um, found the buffalo. Other people say that if you just drive around that um, area, then there should one one should spawn. But I tried that for like ages off camera, but did not find one then I decided to try go on to um, direct mode and go on well now we've got two technically but you know uh, so yeah if there's any other cars that you want me to find um, let me know in the comments uh, Daniel is online cool thanks for interrupting my video um, <coughs> so you're drive into me. Uh, yeah if there's any other vehicles you want me to try and find or find for you um, then let me know in the comments and I'll see you guys in the next video Good bye